With a total student population of 55,000, The Ohio State University is one of the largest universities in the nation. Many students here choose to bike the large campus. However, without designated bike paths in place and so many people on campus at one time, this becomes a huge problem. Watch as this student has to veer off on the grass in order to dodge a bunch of walkers. This girl chooses to slow down a lot to avoid running into walkers instead of going on the grass. The main oval remains the fastest way to get between North and South Campus. This girl has to slow down even more to make a turn with so many walkers on the path and comes very close to colliding with another student. Three. This location is a good example of how bikers are forced between roads and sidewalks. This biker comes close to colliding with walkers and other bikers. Here, these bikers riding on the street get cut off by an Ohio State vehicle. This student biker who chooses to ride on the street is tailed by a vehicle that eventually passes him in a dangerous maneuver. In an effort to promote public safety, transportation and parking services handed out these sheets informing bikers to stay off the sidewalks. The problem is the roads do not connect students with classes and are not safe for bikers. Currently, this remains the only path on campus for bikers and is purely recreational. The Ohio State University needs to create similar bike paths like the one shown here at the University of Illinois, another Big Ten school. Along all major walking paths and streets, they have added biking lanes that allow bikers, walkers, and street traffic to move separately in an efficient and safe manner.